Alright, this is Ray from iPhone Repair. Okay, this is a quick video. I'm just going to run through this really quick so hopefully you guys can keep up. Uh, this is just a uh, supplementary or complimentary video in regards to my how to downgrade the firmware. For the people out there who are having problems when they're downloading the firmware for the iPhone and for some reason if it's downloading in zip instead of with, pardon me, if it's downloading with the .zip extension instead of the .ipsw, uh, you will need to change the extension from zip to IPSW. Everyone's asking how do I do this? It's very simple. If you do a Google search, you can find it, but I thought I'd make a video. Okay, so I'm using Windows 7. Windows Vista is the same thing. Pretty much you go to organize, go to folder search options, choose view. You want to go to here which says hide extension for known file types. Normally that's checked. You want to uncheck that. Hit apply and okay. If you're using Vista, you may have to uh, hit continue because of the user access controls. Uh, but then hit apply and OK. Once you do that, you'll then see the extension. It'll actually show the extension .jpg. Normally, when the extension is hidden, you just see the name of the file. You don't see the extension. All right, now, real simple to rename the file. Now this is a picture, but it's the same thing with uh, a zip or uh, any other file. Right-click on it, go to rename. Very simple. Go over here. Take off the extension, and we're going to change this to PNG, for example. Hit enter. It's going to say, Are you sure? Say yes. And it's now a PNG file. Very simple. For XP users, it's a little bit different. I've already made a video how to do that. I will go ahead and attach that video to this video, and hopefully, this helps you guys out. Is you need to go into Tools, Folder Options. View. You want to go down to hide extension for known file types. You actually want to make sure this is not checked. You do not want this checked. If it is checked, uncheck it, hit apply to all folders, hit apply down here, and hit OK. Once you do that, it will actually start to show you the file extensions. And then you can right click, then you can hit rename. You'll change this from M4A to M4R. Notice what it says here. Now notice what it's going to do after I change it. Do you want to change it? Maybe become unstable? Hit yes.